Uh, yeah, Sans, you're, you're awake before me. <laughs> Morning, bro. Wait, Sans, you didn't sleep at all. Sans, it looks almost as if you're staying up on purpose to protect me from some unseen, possibly imaginary threat. Uh. But that's silly. We both know I'm the stronger brother. I protect you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoopee cushions in the coat. I can't believe you'd start this early. I don't know. I thought it was a breath of fresh air. No! Come on, Peps. I think you need to take all that pent up rage and just release it. You're literally the worst ever! Move on ahead, kid. I gotta change my jacket. See you for breakfast. Be right down. <laughs> Honestly, Sans, either way, the human told me something. After breakfast, they're going to leave. They're very determined to get home, apparently. It makes me feel very conflicted, human. I think I... I would miss having you around. Hmm? Human? What a... <gasps> You spit out your delicious spaghetti just so you can give me such a wonderful message? Oh, I'll be looking forward to eating every visit. Waterfall is much warmer than here, so your outfit should be fine. Oh, I hope you come back often. You've become such a good friend. Hey, kiddo. After my nap, I'll come find you. We can grab grillbies, okay? Maybe Undyne will go easy on him. Fear not. I will simply tell Undyne the human is wearing an old tutu. The human would never be caught dead in such a thing. Huh. You're the smartest skill ever. Eh. Uh, um. So. Sans. Now that we're alone, I wanted to say something. Hmm. Bro. Okay. It has to do with all your recent nightmares. Uh... Bro, you told me I didn't have to talk about it. Oh, and you still don't if you don't want. I just... Sans, I know you better than anyone. And I also know you tend to... Well, you don't tell me much, Sans. I can tell you hide a lot from me. A lot about you. And I also know... That you probably believe you're protecting me by pushing me away. But, Sans, I'm an adult, and the most dedicated brother and friend, and I can handle it. No, I want to handle it, side by side, with you. Burdens just way less that way, for both of us, I think. And maybe you'd feel just a little bit better. Peps? Yes, brother? I saw... No. I felt myself die. I felt myself turn into dust. Wait, you... What? Yeah. It was real. Very, very real. It was like another lifetime. I wasn't the only one who died. I only saw bits and pieces. But I felt the rest. In my dream, I watched Undyne leave to fight. But I knew. No, we both knew. She was walking to her death. And I know. Monsters were dying. Everyone was dying. And. Papyrus? Papyrus? No. Never. I won't let myself see it happen. I can't! I couldn't handle it. How could I handle it then? Why did I make myself watch the recordings of Snowden? Okay, okay, Sans, okay. You don't have to keep going. You're okay. Everyone is okay. Everyone is okay.
Huh. You're right. I feel much better. You're the coolest. Well, brother, under normal circumstances, I would agree. Right now, however... Huh. I am in the presence of the true coolest brother in the world! Bro, what? That's right! I don't care who knows! Like huh. you! Looking for an awesome new brother? Well, too bad! Sans here is already yes. taken! <laughs> Absolutely. You do! My brother is all mine! Hey, you! Bro, I swear! I don't know if I love you or hate you right now. That's such a silly thing to say, Sans! You can never hate me! Sans? Right. You had pretty much zero hours of sleep. Okay, okay, let's get you home, sleepy bones. <laughs> Oh, so perhaps. Sans, you're awake! And no nightmares! Yep, it looks like it. Oh, the TV. Sorry, bro. I didn't mean to. What? Don't be ridiculous, Sans. Besides, the sound still works great, so I get to hear my sexy rectangle at least. This is a sexy rectangle? Oh, uh, where exactly did you hear that word? Oh, remember? We were talking about the box of pasta. No, not rectangle. The word sexy. Oh, Alphys told me that one. She calls on dining meds on that all the time. She told me it's like a really nice compliment. She did now, huh? Yup. So I've been using it for everyone I care about. Undyne, Alphys, Sans, even- Stop this! Make me feel uncomfortable. Uh, I mean... Papyrus, I'm sure she didn't know any better, but I have to tell you, it might be different in Hotland, but around Snowden, that is a very bad word. Huh? Yeah. Oh no, I had no idea. I've been calling you such bad things. Why would she do this? It's okay, bro. It was probably just an accident. I'll go and talk to her, okay? Just wait! Oh, this is the best part! Cool! Hey, Alfie. Heard her teach my bro swears. Sans? What are you doing? Oh, uh, you know. I thought you gills would like a friendly visit. Sans, stop! Don't be so coy. Anyway, Alphys! I've got a bone to pick with you. Uh... My brother was saying the word sexy earlier. Mm. You wouldn't happen to know why, would you? Sans, I'm so sorry I didn't know he was in the room! Tisk tisk, Alphys. Okay, but what the hell? Also, sexy isn't a curse word, Sans. It is when I hear Pap saying it. Like I said, I'm so sorry! I saw the hot pick of my favorite character and it just came out. Okay, okay, Alphys. You're forgiven. Just be careful. Thank you. So, she's not allowed to say sexy in front of Papyrus? That and all the other words on her list. List? Are you serious? <laughs> uh, yeah. I have a swear list right here. See? Hmm. Hey, look at my wrist. It's time for my mid-morning breakfast with the human. You girls have fun. Not a single word on this list is an actual swear word. What the? Crunk? Frumpus? Flumpin? And wait, what the hell is... Is that papyrus with a pineapple for a head? Why? Is it a pun? What the hell? Uh Wait, what did that damn skeleton just say? Human? He's supposed to go down and kill the humans. I swear I'm gonna kill that skeleton and beat him up. I'll make him wish the human killed him first, I swear. She said she's sorry. Sans, you're back. What happened? It was a miscommunication. She promised she never meant to upset you, Paps. Anyway, I think I'm gonna head over and grab the kid to get some breakfast. Sounds good, brother. Speaking of the human, Sans. Have you considered, well, have you considered telling the human about these bad dreams? Yeah, 
A little bit. Why? Well, the nightmare started right before they appeared. I thought somehow they would have something to do with it. Yeah. Thanks, bro. No prob. Have a good breakfast, brother. Thanks. See you later. Bye! Hey, kiddo. Something the matter? You look distracted. No? Alright then. Sorry I'm a little late. What do you say we head to Grillby's? I know a shortcut. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans, you're late today. Usually this is your second breakfast. Sorry, buddy. I don't know what happened. I couldn't get out of bed if I fried this morning. <laughs> Here, get comfy. <laughs> Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grillby, we'll have a double order of bird. I've said something like this before, but having you around has made my brother very happy. I know eventually you'll have to be captured and brought to Asgore, but dunno. Guess I kinda wish it didn't have to happen. Huh. <sighs> There's been something odd. Something I've been trying to figure out. Well, maybe not figure out. It's maybe more like, except what I already know. Be honest with me, kid. I won't judge. Have we met before? And if that's the case, did you hurt them? My friends? My family? Me? Did you kill us all, Frisk? Thanks, Grilby. Looks great. You could have mine, kiddo. These things just go right through me. <laughs> huh? Was that you? You could talk? Kid? I said... Do you remember when I killed everyone, Sans? Hmm. That look on your face, that's the look of someone who's very, very mad. So, how did you do it? After all, up until now, all you did was mumble about reports and time anomalies. But it was pretty obvious you never experienced an anomaly personally. Wait, that's what your nightmares have been about, isn't it? <laughs> So you've only been remembering pieces. So whatever you tried in the last timeline, it didn't work, right? That obviously made you suffer. <laughs> yeah, looks like you got me, kid. Glad I brought you out today. I learned a lot. Uh... I've got a lot of questions answered. So thanks, kiddo. Here's a little treat for you. You know, those who deserve it. Sans, come on. I think it's pretty clear I can reset anything you do. So what? Get dunked on, you gross piece of garbage. Oh, Grillby, sorry about the counter. I was really mad. Yeah, I got enough to pay for repairs. You know, if the world doesn't reset, and if it does, see you on the other side, buddy. I know. It doesn't make sense. I know.
Hey, what do you know? Look at that, kid. Feels like I'm looking straight into a mirror. 